Thank you for plugging into this Family Life News podcast, streaming issues-driven, family-focused news. Welcome to another edition of Hometown Heroes on Family Life. I'm your host, Bill Price. Our guest this week, Del Reed from Buffalo. He runs a t-shirt company where giving back is the name of the game. Why is 26 shirts so special? We are a giving first business. Our goal is to give as much as possible while still staying in business. I always joke that if people found dog food super interesting and wanted different versions every week, that's what we would sell. Mm. Uh, But people don't, and I'm more into t-shirts, so I'm a better fit for that anyways. But for every shirt that we sell, uh, we give a portion back to a local family or a local nonprofit in the Western New York area. To date, uh, we've managed to raise over $1.2 million that we've given back into the community. How I understand it works is you sell a different limited edition sports-themed T-shirt every two weeks, and after that, the design is retired. Yeah, yeah. Actually, um, it's actually every week now, but it's a two-week campaign because they overlap with each other. So every Monday, we're launching a new two-week campaign. It used to be every two weeks, but that's where the name comes from, 26 shirts. 52 divided by 2 is 26. But last summer, in 2020, I was just getting really frustrated with the fact that, you mean we can only help 26 families a year? We can't do better than that? As the business has grown, we've had, you know, a little bit more bandwidth to work with. And so on this end, we did some brainstorming and we thought, you know, we could probably stagger them and then we could help, you know, in that case, 52 families a year. Sure. Not to mention our special editions and stuff. And Quite a lot of themed t-shirts. Now, how do you come up with uh, the themes and the ideas for these shirts, Del? People think it's difficult, and it's difficult some weeks, but when when it's all you do and you have a team of folks, you know, that that's really all we try to do is come up with new ideas. It's not as hard as you would think when that's the only thing you're focused on. We're speaking with Del Reed, the owner of 26 Shirts, and uh, talk to us about some of the families that you guys have been able to help with these t-shirts. You know, often it's a child fighting, you know, cancer or a tumor or something, but not always. We've helped, you know, adults who are dealing with, you know, uh, medical bills that they could use a little bit of assistance with. We've helped families who have, you know, recently lost a loved one that was the main uh, breadwinner in the family. We've helped something lost the house in a fire. Um, so there's, there's, there's really the whole gamut. If, yeah. if you need help, we want to swoop in and, and give you that help if possible. Well, and I know that uh, you're, you're trying to run a business and trying to, to support your family, but at the same time, you're helping out uh, thousands of families in the greater Buffalo region. How's it make you feel, Dell, to play a small part in all of this? Uh, it's surreal, to be honest with you. Um, and it sounds, maybe it sounds corny to say it, but really the true payment I get out of all of this is being able to help these families, but, you know, getting the replies when you're, and it's different every week, you know, some shirts sell more than others. And sometimes it's a windfall for the family. And sometimes it's a little less than what we had hoped to give, but always the replies back from the families are, are thank you. And when like, sometimes the, the kids that we help, they'll send cards drawn with crayons and everything. Like I have a whole bin filled with yeah. those. And those are, those are a true treasure to me. So really mm-hmm. it's um, an honor to be able to play this role in the Western New York community. Do you have a brick and mortar store or is this all online? We're primarily online, although in this past May, we just opened up what we call our retail showroom in TriMain Center in, in the city of Buffalo. It's a small room where people can come in and you know visit us and check out what we have to offer, buy some stuff. We got a couple of exclusives you can only buy you know at the store. And yeah. um, it's just a really cool opportunity, especially you know after the past year and a half, everybody being so isolated. Um, it's really nice to meet our customers face to face. Why did you start this business? You may be familiar with the term Bills Mafia. Oh yeah, uh, yep. Among Bills fans, I'm actually the one that coined that phrase ten plus years ago. Now, uh, I found myself with this big social media audience, and I really, I always joke that I read too many Spider-Man comics when I was a kid, and mm-hmm. Uncle Ben always told Peter, "With great power comes great responsibility." But also, you know, my, my faith and really believing that when you're given a platform, it's not by accident. It, you know, there is, you know, a divine reason that God has 
placed you in this position for a reason. Mm. And so in my heart, I believe that this is what I'm supposed to be doing yeah. is using what I love, whether it's the city of Buffalo and its teams, novelty t-shirts as my mom used to call them when I was a kid yeah. um, and, and, and helping people. So I'm trying to marry those all together. Del Reed from Buffalo, this week's Hometown Hero. Join us next week as we search for your home, your town, your hero. It's Hometown Heroes on Family Life.